Hi, I'm Alex. And I'm Elijah. We run Online Ceramics. And we want you to let your inner kid out to play. I think our online ceramics aesthetic is rooted in a haunted, like a haunted Model T Ford crashing into like what? What is it crashing? It's crashing into, into like a rainbow, yeah. full of like stardust, and like when it crashes into the rainbow, all the skeletons fly out everywhere, yeah, 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 yeah. and then they like start picking up roses and daisies, and then like a fucking goblin shows and up. Then a goblin, <laughs> and then a goblin, and then, and then like out of the goblin's head, a mushroom grows. Yeah. We basically were gonna start like an art store with like sculptures and books and stuff. And then we found out that making t-shirts was a lot cheaper and easier and manageable in an apartment. So we just decided to take that name and apply it to what we were doing because it had nothing to do with making t-shirts. Basically what inspires it is we'll pick like a song, we'll pick like a lyric or a concept, like uh, an image. Or like an image, we'll find an image that really like we dig a lot, you know? Um, and then that usually just snowballs into its whole like, there's like a creative energy around that concept. Sometimes in my mind, the imagery has absolutely nothing to do with the text involved, which I think plays into the whole dialogue of online ceramics not really pertaining to t-shirts, um, where there is like sometimes this context out of context sort of situation that I think kind of all bleeds into each other of this own weird world. Even though people don't always understand what's happening, like they're pumped on it, but we're always like, we have this sentiment like what, how far can we push the images? Like what kind of narratives can we take that are and what, what totally wild that people will still be pumped on? And yeah. Like, I don't know, we entertain ourselves in that way. I think we just like to bring this light into the situation. Yeah. At the yeah. end of the day, that's like, when I'm thinking of this stuff, my end goal is like I want someone to like wear our clothes and be like, damn, I feel really good. I like want to go hang out with people and have fun and I want to enjoy my day. <laughs>